Hey everyone. Today it's time for us to consider another aspect of the subject verb agreement with respect to the first person, second person, third person. So we have already understood how to use has and have. We've also looked at how to use do and does. Now let's look at is, am, are. Okay? Is, am, are. Let's see how we use these three verbs with the subject. So as always, let's begin with the first person. Right. So the first person says, I am going out today. I am an excellent person. I am going to eat some chocolate. That is for I. So what did we say? I am. I am. What about we? The first person itself. But now we are using the plural we. So we are excellent people. We are going to eat some chocolates. We are going out today. So we are. So in the first person you observe a difference. I am. We are. I hope that's clear to you. So you have to make at least 5 to 10 sentences each of this kind so you are clear with it. Now let's go on to the second person. You. You are going out today. You are eating ice cream. You are playing football. You are reading a wonderful book. So you see, you are, I am, we are, you are. Now let's come to the third person. He, she, it. He is writing a book. She is watching television. It is coming home today. He is asking his friend something. She is telling her friend something. It is going to fall down. So he, she, it is. What about they? They are going to fall down. They are watching a film. They are running on the road. They are playing cricket. So you notice the difference? Let me tell you once again. I am. We are. You are. He, she, it, is. They are. That is our session on subject verb agreement. So this completes with our series on the subject verb agreement on a very very simple note. So please practice these sentences repeatedly and perfect it. So the next level we can go on to something slightly more complicated. Alright, so until next time, bye.